In the years following World War II, the U.S. was searching for the next leap forward in strategic bombing. One of the boldest designs to emerge was the Northrop YB-49, a pure flying wing, no fuselage, no tail, just an enormous swept wing filled with fuel, crew compartments, and eight jet engines buried inside the structure itself. Jack Northrop had long believed the flying wing was the most aerodynamically efficient aircraft shape possible, producing more lift with less drag than any conventional airplane, and in flight the YB-49 proved him right. It was fast, stable at altitude, and a low radar profile exactly what a long-range nuclear-era bomber needed. But the design came with challenges. Without a vertical tail, the aircraft could be difficult to control. Fuel consumption was high, the program suffered setbacks, including a tragic crash, and ultimately, the Air Force selected the more conventional B-47 and later the B-52. Yet Northrop's dream didn't die. Half a century later, the concept resurfaced in the B-2 spirit, which ultimately achieved what the YB-49 had pioneered. If you'd like to see how Northrop wanted to take this idea even further, check the pinned comment for a link to a promotional video on the proposed flying airline.